Hey y'all, what's up? This is your boy Ricardo Screen Print Shop over here. All right. I'm back with another video for y'all. I have not posted in a long while. You know, it's just been busy, I guess, doing other things, you know. But I'm back. It's 2021 already. Okay. So I have just decided to uh check out sublimation because I've been doing screen printing and heat transfer. So I wanna check out sublimation, okay? All right? Before we do anything, before we jump into everything that I'm doing right now, do me this favor, like, subscribe to this channel so you can see all my stuff when I post them because I post some pretty good stuff on there every now and then. I don't post all the time, but every now and then. So please, like, subscribe to this channel so you can see my cool stuff when I post them. All right, here's what we're doing today. We have Cosmos Inc. So I'm gonna be um, converting my Epson printer into a sublimation printer, if I'm saying that right, because I'm not all that, all that savvy with this sublimation thing. So I'm going to be learning how to do it. So I just checked out um, Cosmos YouTube channel and I and he taught all of that on his channel how to convert your Epson printer into a sublimation printer so I got all my stuff delivered to me I bought this whole thing it was fairly cheap it wasn't too expensive because people a lot of people are saying that this ink is pretty good so I'm gonna go with this Cosmos ink and check it out so I'm gonna jump into it fill my cartridges because they come with those refillable cartridges and syringes and needle all that good stuff so you can convert your Epson printer into a sublimation printer so subscribe to this channel like my videos hit that bell this notification bell so anytime I post my stuff on there you will get the, the, the notification and you can get to watch that video as soon as I post them. All right. So stay tuned for that. Once again, I'm learning how to do it. I'm not teaching, teaching how to do it. If you want to see how I do it, you can watch the video and maybe you can learn something. I don't know. So stay tuned. Peace and love. I'll be right back. And you get to see everything. All right. Love y'all. Hey guys. So I'm going to do one of the cartridges so you can see how I um I refill the cartridges with um with ink okay I have the magenta over here I'm going to refill I just watched the video the video that shows how to refill it because I didn't know how to do that myself so I just watched the video now I know how to do it I've already done two of them and um, you guys can see how I do it. So I give it a little shake. I don't know if I'm supposed to shake it. So give it one little shake. Okay, I open the bottle. Okay, I get my syringe. I get my needle. Okay, put the needle in the syringe. Okay, and then I get. I get put ink in the syringe. Okay. Do that. Bang, bang, bang. And then it has two opening. Okay, but you only remove the little pink area over here, the pink um, plug. Or if it's blue, take the blue blue plug out. Or if it's yellow, take the yellow plug out. And it has another plug over here. You don't put the ink in there. You put the ink at where to, wherever you remove the, the, the plug cut with the color in it. That's where you put the ink. So you put the ink in here. Over here, all in there. Okay, all in there. Nice and slow. 
don't create any bubbles just put the ink in nice and slow okay just like that remove it if you need more put it down get some more ink do the same thing put the syringe in there put the ink in just like that boom once you finish put the plug back in and i did that as you can see you cannot see it can you see it yeah you can see it right there i did not create any bubbles as you can see no bubbles everything is nice and clean okay and then when you're gonna put it back in the printer, the plug in the back, take that plug out, the one in the back. I take it out because that's supposed to be, that helps the thing, I guess, air to circulate and breathe. So take that plug out. That's what it, that's what it said to do. So that's what I'm doing. And then, I think I got some ink back on here. Put the ink back on here. Okay. There's a trick. It says to um put take the syringe, take the uh the needle out, right? And then put it back in here at the bottom where that's supposed to be like for the printer. You purge it by purging it is pull ink into the drain pipe so that way you don't end up having to do too much print head cleaning I guess to get the ink to come out out of the out of the cartridge so it says to purge it put this thing in there and pull the ink out so that take a little minute so I did it a little minute but i'm gonna show you guys hopefully that one didn't take too long but the other ones took a while for the ink to finally come out so yeah right there i put the ink back at the bottom of the, sy the syringe at the bottom and then this is to pull and hold so that you pretty much forces the ink to go through that drain pipe. It's coming out a little bit, not much, but this helps you just hold it there until the ink come out. The, it's kind of hard, cause out of pressure, but just hold it there and then the ink comes out. Just gonna hold it here. Okay, I think. Oh, okay, there it is. It comes out. Now we're good to go. Okay, so now I'm gonna put the syringe back in here. Ah, I got it all over my finger. So I'm gonna take this thing out again, the plug out. So I'm gonna put the ink back in here. Got some bubbles. I think I can put some more ink in here. So while I'm at it, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put some more ink back in there. Kind of messy.
Boom. Did that. Put the plug back in. All right, now I'm gonna put it in the printer. Boom. I'll put it in the printer. This can out of printer. All right, guys, you seen how I did it? So, if you wanna see the result when I print the, my first t-shirt doing sublimation, stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel and make sure you hit that bell so you can get the, the, the videos as soon as I post them, guys. As soon as I post the videos, if you hit that bell, you'll get the notification. You will get the notification, all right? Stay tuned, that's how I do it. I'm not too glad to show what's happening here. Okay, I'm gonna put my... Put this thing over here. It's a test run. Just to make sure this thing is running good. And it's gonna be on there for a whole minute, guys. A whole minute. A whole minute. I think everything is cooking. So I have to get um I have to get um minute guys <laughs> my first of the mission cosmos ink look at that baby them colors that color is fire what? What? stay tuned y'all there's see. more coming Daddy. hit that bell Daddy. get your notification bell on Daddy, get it